Evaluate the expression arc cosine of one half. So there's some angle that creates a cosine of one half. So arc cosine is the inverse of the cosine function. So what this is saying is cosine of some angle x equals one half, and we want to know what that angle is. Well, let me sketch the quadrants here briefly. The range of the inverse cosine is from 0 to pi, so all the values have to be somewhere in here. Now this cosine, the arc cosine value is positive, which means it has to be in quadrant 1 somewhere. So I'm going to draw my triangle right here in quadrant 1. Okay, now the ratio is 1 half, so we need to know the cosine of what angle makes 1 half. And it has to be in terms of radians. I know that the cosine of pi over 3 equals 1 half. And so what that looks like on the right triangle, you have a 2, a 1, and a square root of 3. That's what the right triangle would look like. Of course, when I sketch this right triangle, it's not a unit circle right triangle, but it's the easiest way to show you what the ratios are. So knowing your sine, cosine, and tangent values really helps you with this inverse function business, because if you don't have those memorized, it gets pretty complicated. But if you do, you should be good to go.